What's happening, Internet? It's your buddy Mitch Santono from Mitch's Drive Through, and I've got a new series to share with you today. I'm calling this one Trash or Treasure. I've got 2023's Burger King Bat Wheels full collection. Is it trash or is it treasure? First one we're taking a look at is this motorcycle. It does not come with stickers, but you can put them on. They do look like they glow. That's kind of neat. It's one of those toys that goes like this, and you let it go. I got to say, that's not too bad for a little gimmicky toy that you get for free, and that's why this is a treasure. Man, look at this thing. It's like the Batwing or something, the Bat Jet, the Bat Boat, the Bat something hovercraft. Comes with a giant Bat Wheels missile. And you know what we do with that? We stick that right in there, and there's a button on the back. You just push it, and let's see how much strength it has. Let's see if this one's going to be trash or treasure, people. Oh, not too bad, not too bad. Come on, we'll give it another shot here. I do like shooting toys, my spring-loaded shooting gimmicks. Not too bad, not too hard. I think this guy is treasure, treasure. Next, we have Robin. I haven't even tried this thing out yet. I mean, he looks okay. Uh, he's a little awkward, though. Like, if you just want to stand this thing up uh, and have him on your shelf, I don't know. I guess he's all right. Kind of dynamically posed. We'll give him his weapon. You're supposed to plug this into his arm like this, and it's supposed to stay in his arm like this, and I guess that's it. And then you got this little, uh oh, uh, oh. Uh, now, come on now. Come on now. It's supposed to plug into the arm just like that, and then you got this thing, and you can... Oh my gosh, what in... <laughs> so that's what this does, huh? I mean, Robin looks cool, but this gimmick is terrible. I am sorry, my friend. Next, we've got the Batmobile looking like it just came off the set of cars. And it looks neat. It's got some glowy in the darky, I think, uh, hubcap stickers. I stuck all those on, so I immediately had some fun doing that. This is a pullback toy, and normally these things are replayable. I dig it. Pull it back. Doesn't go too fast, but I didn't pull it back all that far. I guess he zips along. And you know what? This thing isn't too bad. I kind of dig it. You I shall treasure. Next up, this is Cat Woman, Cat Girl. Not sure. It's kind of a figurine. It stands sort of. Bit of a weird pose. Not too big of a fan of that pose. Looks a little weird. Legs are a little bit warped and bent in weird angles. Now, this arm is supposed to just freely <laughs> do this. I'm not sure what's going on with this arm here. It's like a it's like a karate chop, but it's kind of a it's kind of a dance move. Like and it, and it gets going, and it's kind of like you know when the two people stand next to each other and they do the little wavy thing. It's almost like that with the arms when you go like that. <laughs> it's making me laugh. You're supposed to activate it with this thing, right? You get the thing, the winder thing. And then I suppose I'm supposed to karate chop. But man, is that ineffective. This thing belongs in the trash. And lastly, we have Batman. Can he save this set? He looks weird. He's in that weird pose, the splayed legged pose. And it looks like he's about to punch something. Not sure. It looks more like a bro fist coming at you. This is like the, the old talk to the hand, not to the face thing or whatever. Remember that old thing from the late 80s, early 90s? I don't know. He's got some articulation here with this arm. Head doesn't move. Legs don't move. This does move. I guess it's supposed to punch. Let's see the. Let's see what this does here. Let's. Oh my gosh! Really, Burger King? That's the. That's the punch, huh? That's what we're. That's what we're saying is a cool thing. <laughs> like if I could move it or something, it would be kind of cool. This looks like he's doing a clothesline move, like in WWF. As much as I love Batman and Burger King, I gotta call this one. Bat trash. Overall, ladies and gentlemen, we have a split decision. The figurines are hot trash, and the vehicles, I think, are pretty decent. So, if you're looking to buy this set, just know that half of it's good. Take care, everybody. Thanks for watching. I'll be back with some more Trash or Treasure, where we're going to explore all of the sets that I've done in the past and new ones to come. Take care, everybody.